Jim, seriously? I'm under here. Jim! Jeez. Oh my goodness. I don't know if I can work with this guy. Ah, uh, just kidding. Jim, I told Jim to unfold it, but uh, it appears that it, it doesn't fit in here. I'm over here helping uh, Zach and Jim out. Basically, we are replacing the points, getting ready for some deep tilling. Zach wasn't able to get all to all his fields uh, last uh, fall because uh, the ground froze way too quick. But uh, he's hoping he can use this machine. Uh, he doesn't know for sure, but if not, I guess it's ready for next fall. Really? So Zach just invited me to the annual Lori street sale. I'm pretty interested. If not, I can at least eat some cotton candy. Come on. Okay, a corn dog? Okay. Man, Zach and Jim just are on my case. So I, I got my hands dirty and I don't I'm a millennial, so I, I need to go wash up. So I'm going to take my bike back home, get washed up, and then hopefully meet Zach and Jim over there. Are you checking out my butt? Come on. Yeah, so I do like riding the bike, even though it's on country roads. It's a little dangerous riding a little street bike down these, but... I live for dangerous. If you don't know, I did a little pig yard renovation here, and this is my house. That's Zach's over there, all the way over there to the grain bins, way off in the distance. And this is my house. I can keep tabs with them at my garage. I'm uh, just joking. I don't have my garage door opener on my bike there. Love my little street bike, especially just for fun. There we go. Honey, I need my britches. What are you doing? Get out of here. I'm taking a bath. Jeez. Sorry about that. Forgot to let the camera on. All right. All cleaned up. Got my new britches on. All right. Wasted too much time already. Yeah. Of course I'm going to drive it. Why not? Oh, look at that timing. Oh, yeah. Hey, Zach. I know you got some uh, racing blood in you. And, oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, can't beat the SS, buddy. Seriously, I don't know where to go, though. I'm going to have to wait. Whoa. Okay. Might have made him a little mad. Uh, I don't know if there's something wrong with the steering, or uh, he's just uh, trying to mess with me. Ooh. Big. Versatile. Very nice. Look at all that stuff. Midwest Machinery's got some pretty green paint and a versatile in there, apparently. Look at all that prettiness. Whoa, what do we have here? Ooh, whoa, I see a lot of truck up there. Whoa, 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 that is impressive. Wow, this whole street shuts down. Look at all that stuff. All right, shut the whole party down. A Prius wants through. <laughs> Stinking Prius, get out of here. Wow. Look at all these trucks. Oh, look at this Chevy with a box on the back. Wow. 
Bose Customs, Silverado 4500 HD. Zach, what you... Uh, I'm pretty sure Zach's over there looking at some green. Yep, looking at the green paint. Look at these slicks on here almost. Wow, that's impressive. That's, that's too much truck for our operation. So if you don't know, I'm trying to... I, I did run into a little bit of money. Sold my other farm, got some money. What do you do when you have money and you just purchase another farm? Yeah, that's... Yeah, we're not doing that, but we're buying a new truck. I'm, I'm sure we could figure out something to do with this on the farm. If Zach would be over here, maybe we can uh, do some, uh, some deals in the back of the truck. No, I'm just joking. Don't stop my day job. That's right, Zach. Day job is a farmer and a farmhand. Look at this. Power wagon. Impressive. Love the flags on the back. Pretty impressive uh, old uh, Dodge. What do they call this? Is this... That's the Hemi. 6.4 liter. Ooh. The big Hemi. Now this would be a work truck. Got uh, smoked out lenses in the front. It's a uh, one ton with a flat bed on the t back. Nice. Oh, look at the interior. Yeah, looks like the radio thing needs to be reset, but otherwise, I'm pretty impressed. Yeah, pretty impressed. Bed don't stick out too far, which a lot of them do. Not impressed with. Now, whew. Now this is a pretty girl right here. Man. What is this? Uh, Cheyenne 30, huh? Look at that. A little bit of lift kit on it. What is that? About a 6 inch lift, maybe? Oh, clean interior. Man, almost too clean. I feel bad with bringing my dirty boots in this thing. Oops. Is anybody looking? No. We'll make a quick exit. Ah, I wouldn't mind having this uh, little uh, workhorse around the farm. What is this? An international. New style international. The Workstar. Man, that train's loud over there. Quiet down over there. I'm trying to truck shop. We got a Bronco over here. Look at that. Pretty impressed. Very clean interior. I like it. Yeah. Pretty clean interior about this thing. Hmm. This is uh, definitely an option. We you can always, you'd be amazed how much you'd actually use one of these around the farm. A little tandem axle. We can even put a uh, grain box on the back or use it to pick up bales. Uh, big one ton Denali. Very impressive. I don't know if that, uh, the motor sounds about right. Well, it might sound a little bit off to me. SRT. This is a one ton SRT? I don't really see many of them. Well, I guess it is a dually. This is just a big slick on the back? Yes. Uh, this is trouble. Oh, don't worry. You still have a gooseneck. Not to worry here. Look how low this thing is to the ground. That is low, folks. Look at this little uh, single cab. Duramax 350. Uh, 18 or 19 model. Let's see if this thing starts up. Starts up nicely. What? What do we have here? Hey, somebody jacked your tire. Yeah, I'm not kidding. Get over here. Somebody jacked this tire. 
Now, this Duramax 6.6 uh, .6 Allison transmission leader GMC. Uh, smoked out lenses there. All the way from New York, huh? A long way. We got a flatbed on it. Very clean little type of work truck we have here. Not a bad looking uh, work truck. Hmm. What is this? What is this? About 2011. One ton dually. Board here. A little, uh, gas tank on the back. This would be an option to have. Hey, I'm trying to truck chop. Hmm. Clean. Very clean. Oh, they put some trucks on a lift up here. This is just like my old truck, my Denali HD 8 2018. That's Summit White all the way around. Very clean. Love my old truck. Uh, F-250. Little high boy edition here. Ah, look at that American flag on the back. I really like the looks of this truck. They did a great job on this truck. I don't know if these are other customers' cars or just uh, sightseers or what. I mean, you really can't help it. If you shut down a street, there's going to be a car show on it. I mean, it, that's just how it goes. This reminds me of my grandpa's uh, Cobra here. He actually made his own dash just like this, all wood. Very impressive. His was a kit car, but it doesn't really matter. It still had the feel. Miss that car. Miss him. To be honest, I have to say, when Zach said there'll be some uh, new Chevys over there, Oh, really new GMC's I kind of got pretty excited like oh my goodness I have to go just have to go and this is the ultimate camper here so impressed with this camper look at it love the interior just love that stitching hmm very Man, this would be an expensive camper to have, especially you could bring everybody. Man, look, that is the ultimate camper. The Fleetwood on the back of an AT4. You would basically, you would lose all of your off-road ability, or most of it at least, but I kind of like it pretty much matches. I like, oh buck. I think this one looks better. Look at this. I don't know what this color is. AT4 HD Duramax 6.6 .6 liter. Oh yeah. Look at that. Very clean. Very clean. Now, what is this? This metallic blue? Don't know what blue this is, but I kind of like. Almost looks like my in real life truck right there. Almost. Oh, AT4 HD. Man, look at that. Is that metallic? Look at that bling on there. Huh. I don't know exactly what kind of color that is. That must be a specially made model. Very impressive. Then we got this red. Uh, Zach. Back off, this one, I might want this one, okay? Back off. I, I think I saw when I was walking down the other line, Zach was actually looking at this one. I don't know for sure, but I know he's interested in another truck, but I don't think he likes diesel. Oh, we got this one. Oh man, I got so many options. Look at all these different whites. I didn't even know they had this many whites. Is this Summit white, or is that just regular white? can't tell oh, oh look at this big lifted beast here oh, what? 
man, somebody spent a lot of money on an already expensive truck. Look at that metallic paint, too. Man. Man, AT4 has already got some off-road capability. Why would you want to... Alright, i got to figure out. I think... This one right here. I think I am going to have to get this thing. You guys are going to get on my case for having... Uh, too many uh, GMCs. Oh man. I don't know. Should I get this one? Or, or red over here? I made up my mind. Gonna get this old girl. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you next time. Over here in the cold Minnesota. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share and subscribe. Zach, stop messing around with that green paint over there. Yeah, it's mine. If you really want a computer that can handle all these mods that you just saw on this game, check out Apex Gaming PCs. They make PCs that will run on just about any combination of mods, even the load I put on my PC. Use the code SQUAD.